Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are doing fine. Whenever there is a change in the magnetic flux linked with the coil, an EMF is induced in that coil. It is known as Faraday's first law of electromagnetic induction. In today's video, we are going to verify Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction with the help of a few experiments. Here I have a galvanometer which is connected to a coil of enameled copper wire with the help of two crocodile clips. I have one bar magnet. We know there is a space around a magnet called as magnetic field. This magnetic field have magnetic field lines in them. Uh, when a magnet is brought near to an object, the magnetic field lines get linked with those. The number of magnetic field lines crossing per unit area of any object is referred as magnetic flux. When I keep uh, this magnet near to this uh, coil, the magnetic flux will get linked with this coil. When the magnetic flux linked with the coil changes with time, an EMF is induced in that coil. When uh, the EMF induces in the coil, it shows deflection in the galvanometer. Now let me show that to you. Now first I move this magnet inside the coil. To very carefully what happened. When I do so, when I move slowly, you may find the deflection in the galvanometer in a particular direction. When the magnet is kept at rest, no deflection is observed. Now I will pull out the magnet. Go here carefully what happened. I have pulled out the magnet slowly. So, at least deflection is observed in the opposite direction. Now I reverse the magnet. I keep the south pole towards the coin. Now look at it carefully. When I move the magnet inside the coin, the deflection is observed in this direction. Now when I pull the magnet out, the deflection gets reversed. Now I am going to increase the speed of movement of the magnet inside the coin. See, when I move the, coil, the magnet, it is faster, the deflection has increased. This shows that the magnitude of induced EMF depends on the relative motion between the coil and the magnet. Uh, Michael Faraday's first law of electromagnetic induction says that whenever there is a change in the magnetic flux linked with the coil, an EMF is induced in the coil. We call that the EMF as induced EMF. And uh, Faraday's second law of electromagnetic induction says that the magnitude of induced EMF is directly proportional to the rate of change of magnetic flux linked with that coil or conductor. I hope uh, this video is useful. If you have any kind of doubt related to the topic, kindly put your questions in the comment section. Thanks for watching.